Man, the weather is perfect today and not hot and not cold. <coughs> it's nice and cool. So, I feel like I'm feeling a lot better now. Trust me, I'm probably over this sickness by now. If anything, I just have just a slight cough. But nothing to go scream and cry to your mom about. But anyways, hello, you guys. Welcome back to the COVID Fire Show. I'm feeling great. I'm feeling alive. You guys should feel great and feel alive as well because today is Thursday. I'm almost running out the weekend of Friday. So I'm feeling, I'm just feeling like weight has been lifted on my shoulders. You know, so just, just chase your dreams. Like I always say, I haven't done it in a while. But seriously, chase your dreams, follow your dreams. You know, if you, if you don't go, if you don't do anything, you're going to be stuck in that same thing and you're going to be miserable for the rest of your life and you don't want to do that. And you don't want to do that. That happens. So I want you guys to stay on track, focus, chase your dreams, whatever, whatever your passion is, go for it. If you love to do whatever, I don't even care if you love to freaking weld or cook or play a sport, tennis, hockey, whatever, baseball, whatever. Go follow that dream. Chase it. Because if you don't and you say, oh, I want to be a baseball player and oh, I want to be the next MLB star. Okay, and you play baseball way to high school, whatever. Uh, I'm going to chase and go far. I want to be a baseball player, right? So to play high school, oh, I don't want to know if I want to be a baseball player anymore. It's like, you had this whole passion in your head that, oh, I want to do this. Oh, I want to be a baseball player. Oh, I want to go far. I want to you know, go to college baseball, be a star, and then go to MLB. If I get drafted to the MLB, I'll get drafted to the MILB, you know, the minor leagues, whatever. So chase that dream. Whatever you want to do, chase it, follow it. And I know we all get sidetracked. I do myself. So if I'm trying to chase my dream, because I want to be a cook. Obviously, I'm still doing YouTube, but I love to do drums on a side gig, like do like a little band on a side gig. I love to do some cooking. If I want to do that, I'm just ready to go follow cook. I'm gonna go do this. If you guys want to do whatever, scratch your butt. Be a professional butt scratcher. Chase your dream. Follow it. Do it. Always don't get sidetracked. Always don't put things out to the last minute. Oh, I have a pain in my arm and it still hurts. And you wait till like the last minute it gets really worse and worse and worse. And then, then, then it just. And it just hurts, and you're like, oh, I should have gone to the doctor, and then you finally go, and it's like, get all these bad results. So don't put anything off to the last minute, okay? This is me, just a quick motivational thing, I don't know. I just want to talk about it, because I just feel great waking up this morning. But, uh, let's talk playoffs. Are you guys excited? Today, I mean, actually, sorry, yesterday, a couple couple good slow games. I saw the Canadians and the Rangers, and, uh, come on. And what a game by the Rangers and the Canadians. And the Rangers went 2-0. Even the Pittsburgh Penguins, cool. <laughs> they, they might even go back. They might even go back. Uh, they might. They might even go back. I, I, I don't know. They, they might go back. They might go back to the playoffs. But anyways, we're here to talk. My Anaheim Ducks. Or playing host. So we're, we're the team that's hosting them. So we're going to play at our home. I guess the Calgary Flames round one. We played today. I think we're going to Calgary. I'm not sure we're going to Calgary. Saturday. But I'm excited for this. We, we're playing hot right now. I think we have I don't remember the last time we lost a game. Like, trust me. Last time we won a game was against the Kings. It was like last... Sunday? It was Sunday, and I was, and then remember that when they were there, and was like, thank you, Bob, thank you, Bob, was just, thanks, Bob, thank you, thank Bob Miller, or his name is, I don't mean, I, I never knew the guy, never knew he did, I never knew what, what he used what he used to do or did, so I guess he was commentary for the Kings, I guess he did the Mighty Ducks, was it part two movie? I think it was part two movie, I'm not, I'm not sure, but, uh, hold on. I'm only in trouble, hold on. Put the house.
cross their hands and do not disturb me. And every time I talk, they come looking at like. So. Okay, but uh, anyways. <clears throat> so we're playing really good hockey. Our players are just playing phenomenal game. I did a couple of decks videos on my channel, but it was getting somewhat views, but nothing too to scream crying to your mom about. So I'm going to see if this player forms a kit. I'm going to your mom about, but I'm excited for these playoffs. I don't know if Ricard, Ricard Raquel is still. He might be still suspended, so he might have to miss, miss a playoff game. Maybe miss his playoff game or miss his week of playoffs. Um, we're out with Cam Fowler. He might be back if, soon, I hope. Um, he had an injury, so I think he, I hope he's back in time for this round if we make it to the second round, which I'm not going to say make if we. We are going to make this Calgary Flames. And this Calgary Flames had pull a hat, 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 a hat out of the hat. No, right out of the hat. And, and then, <coughs> sorry, and then they just kill it. And then, I don't know. We're, we're, we're going to find out tonight. I'll be at the gym and they're going to have it because I'll be at NBC, NBC at 10. And I'll be at the gym and the game's on. So I'll definitely be watching it when I do the elliptical. Because what the elliptical is like straight shot TV, so. I'll probably do like an hour on the elliptical just to watch the game. <laughs> I'll do a little weights. If we get there early, I'll do a little weights. I think it's at 7.30, so before 7.30. I'm going to do some weights. If we get there like at 7, would it? No. I think I'm going to go straight to the elliptical today. Because my dad's, today's my dad's late day, so when he gets home, it's like late. Because we go to the gym together, obviously. But um, I'm excited, so... Getzloff is playing great. Perry's playing great. You know, um... Eve, what's his name? Is it Eves? I think I said it right. Eves? Eves, Evan? Eves? I think it's Eves. If I'm not mistaken, it's, it's Eves. I think it's Eves. Come on. I think it's Eves or something like that. But we, all the players that we have are really good. Speed is playing good. You know, we have good rotation lineup, but I'm just worried. Because we got because we, we had our old coach since we won the Stanley Cup of 07. You know. Okay. So in 07. We had Carlisle. Randy Carlisle. Then we had this other guy. Come on, Car. And we had this other guy, you know. So I'm, in a, so I'm in Minnesota now, which is like uh, Bruce Boudreaux. He's out in Minnesota now. Let's see, let's see, got. Took an off, and this is like another car. It's been like right next to the. So some of these houses are right next to I'm gonna go all the way. I don't know. But then we have Bruce Boudreaux. He's gone. Then we get Ricard, and then we get, uh, then we get Randy Carlisle back. I'm not Toronto. Guess what? <laughs> when we get him back, all of a sudden, boom. <laughs> the Toronto Maple Leafs make playoffs. When he was a team, I don't think they even made playoffs. If they did, they probably get eliminated. So I feel like our coach system is going to give us a shit and just like, if we win this series and win maybe the second series because Edmonton or San Jose, if we, whoever wins that one plays, whoever wins Calgary and my Ducks. And after that, we'll play. I hope it's not Chicago again because <coughs> cause last year, we went to the third round. We played Chicago. And then we lost. Like, it, was game, it was game seven. I remember watching it. was game seven. I was... Pretty sure it was... Yeah, Chicago. Game seven. They just freaking... It was... It, it wasn't pretty. Let's just put it like that. We always choke up against Chicago. In the regular season, it's all fine and dandy. We beat them. We just beat them not too long ago. Another couple weeks ago. We had them like four zero something like that. Yeah, I mean, uh, yeah, I know. So then, <clears throat> then we had this happen. Every time we play in the playoffs, we're just like, we win a couple, lose a couple. Then we're getting usually game seven or game six, game five, whatever. All goes into the trash. We just fail, and and I think 07, we could have had them. Oh no, 07. Last year in game seven. We could have had him easily. 
I had him. But it's just it's just like come on. We just choke up. We we it's always Chicago. Maybe if it's Detroit too, but we always choke up, so we'll see. I hope we hope Chicago gets a little quicker. So to play Chicago and we can just get right into the freaking Stanley Cup, man. If it's Ducks, Penguins, I don't mind it. If it's Ducks, whoever, I don't mind it. I don't want to win another Stanley for the state of California. And people are going to say, oh, the Kings, the Kings are better. The two Stanley's. And then all our retaliations are to that, where it is. Who's the first in California to get it? Like, it doesn't matter who has two. So, so. Oh, who has two and da 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 and all this bull shit. You know? But I feel like we're gonna have a good game out. The final score, it's gonna be a close one. Get Calgary's gonna give us run for the money. You know, they have really, they have really good players. Pretty sure it, it's a good drill. Original Calgary. They have good players, it's just. Yeah, basically, everybody in the state of Canada, besides the Canucks, are in the playoffs, which is kind of shocking. <laughs> the Canucks made it, and they'll be like every team in Canada made the playoffs. So we have Ottawa, Calgary, Montreal, and Toronto, and Edmonton. So Montreal, Calgary, Ottawa, so Montreal, Calgary, Ottawa, Toronto, Edmonton. All they all they need is the Canucks and have every team in Canada make it to the playoffs. Every team north of the border could have made it, but except that one team that was Calgary, not Calgary, that was Vancouver. So it would, it would be crazy. It's crazy. So let's see if we can eliminate because so far all the all the teams that played. So I guess we played. Montreal played, Edmonton played last night, and uh, I played Edmonton played in March, I think. I, I, if I'm not mistaken, if I didn't see the score of Edmonton, so I don't know. I predict they might have lost. If they did, that would have been a clean sweep right there. Three losses. That would be the first loss for the team in the playoffs. Because Montreal lost, and Ottawa lost. So that's, that's the last both teams northern of the border there. So we're going to eliminate all the Canadian teams. Just be America playoffs only. I approve. So we'll, we'll see. We'll see what happens. We, we just got to play a good, good lineup and do not choke up. That's what we tend to do. Always in the third round. Sometimes second. Like when we played Dallas. I forgot what year it was. I don't know if it was last. It was one year we played Dallas. I think it was second round. That's why like we're choking up, like we're gonna lose. Like, oh my god, this is it, this is it. Because Dallas gives around for money. I think Dallas might be in, I'm not, if I'm not mistaken. But, uh, anyways, we gotta play a good game. We have really good players. All of them gets off. Really good, really good players get off. And Perry and Spiza. And we just. We just gotta put, put more. Just gotta put more effort in the games. Maybe we can just sweep the Calgary Flames and we can just wait it out, but then play Edmonton or San Jose. Good for San Jose. Not to be a tough one. San Jose doesn't give us enough money. People think San Jose doesn't go all the way. They need a Stanley because. Because besides the Kings and Ducks, we're the only team in California that has the answer. So, and plus, you guys, for the, if you guys follow the Miners, our minor league team made it too. So, we're hoping to win the AHL Cup, whatever they call it. Was it Calder, Calder Cup? Yeah. Our uh, San Diego Goals, the Ducks Minor League, they made it. So, they win the Cup. Calder Cup, that'd be awesome. So, well, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Uh, I, I think because their last game was last night for the goals, so uh, they they play on some like next week or something. 
I don't see tickets going to Seattle. Let's go to Gold's because I live in San Diego. I don't live too far from San Diego, like 10 minutes, 20 minutes away. But Ducks is like an hour and 45 minutes from the stadium. So, fortunately, I'm going to watch the TV. Unless I have the money, I really want to go down there, but take the train. Because it's a beautiful ride to take the train. Because Josh is right there by Angel Stadium. It's not far for the Honda Center. Beautiful ride. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. We're going to win. We're going to win. Use the hashtag paint orange. Or paint it orange. It's called paint it orange or paint orange. And then you actually get the <coughs> Facebook frame of the uh, Anaheim Ducks paint it orange. Uh, I have that. So about the win, but I do have that. So paint it orange. I just put it on my Facebook today. Paint it orange. Hashtag 20 or hashtag paint it orange. Stanley Cup 2017. For you Ducks fans are watching this, go check it out. We we just gotta play really good hockey. You know, we don't wanna give any bad passes. You know, play smart. Don't get to a lot of penalties. And just if we if we do all that right, have a good game. We're keys to victory. I feel like we can make we can Get to the Stanley Cup this year. I feel like it. We have the we have a team that's been great since last year. Last year, great team. This year, we produced better. So, if we can do that, I didn't wear my jersey because it's kind of hot out. <coughs> but I wear my jersey. Maybe I don't know when I get back at the game. I'll wear my jersey. I think it's one of Mike's my favorite. So about the win. I'm gonna pick up the win, and I'll see you guys later. Hashtag. Paint it orange and let's go ducks. Let's go ducks. Let's go ducks.